Hi friends, welcome to Testing Tutorials Point. This is Lokesh Gorantra and today we are going to discussing about mobile automation testing by using Python. Hi friends, welcome back and today we are going to discussing about first test case, how we can able to create. A simple example I am going to show you, not uh, much a difficulty one. Like, I uh, will show you that first, okay. Command prompt. And here I'm going to take it actually in a settings. If you go for like this and settings and there is a battery, just will click and close this app, which is the app we opened that particular app. We are going to close it. This is an action. How uh, like if you communicate with that particular uh, browser, if I'm going to see now this is uh, 4724 I'm just I'm going to start the server CMD appm hyphen p I'm going to start for server okay 4724 that is a server appm server I'm going to start here Once it is started, we can able to now that Appium server, the port is 4724, it is starting. Okay. Now I'm going to start the session. Oh, still it is under purpose. Okay. Sorry, the version is 13. It is 11 it is there that's why it is getting some failed once it is connected we can able to see for here there are a couple of things we need to know about it okay and here you need to click for settings clicking here and clicking that particular one and then we can refresh and here battery okay once you see the battery here you can uh, see for package is there uh package com dot dot settings this you have to remember actually we are going to use this particular uh app package okay and now for this you need to go for appium and here we already installed a latest version of uh, appium that is a three version okay basically most of the member are using for this is the appium 3.0.0 okay this i explained into my previous uh, videos okay you can go through that okay that is a appium python client okay and then you need to click here and click for python file and here you can add for first demo okay you can choose based upon your convenient i choose for app in this one okay now after that we need to add for desired capability and all everything one by one okay and here you have to remember that particular app package okay now i'm going to first from appm import web driver okay this is the first one then we required for one more thing appm typing from typing uh, import any and dist these are the two things i'm going to importing okay after that i'm going to use for appm options okay appm dot options dot common and input appm options this is the one we are going to import it okay and then we can import one more thing as well common but here i'm going to use for 
web driver common and dot appm by the same thing we need to use it here appm by okay this is the one we need to do it okay then after that i'm going to use for cap same colon and here dist and here square brace str string format uh, comma any okay these are the two things and then i'm going to use for equal symbol and two curly braces and here i'm going to use for my desired capability the desired capability i provided here you can uh, app him inspector location if i close here again this is the desired capability right these are the things we, uh, we need to provide one by one okay we can see and now this is the server it is uh the server it is started for 4724 right that same server i'm going to use for here as well okay and here i'm going to use for platform name okay this is a platform name and here the platform name is android okay comma and then you need to use for again semicolon oh, sorry automation name that is ui automator automator 2 okay i know already that's why i'm going to enter one by one okay you can uh, uh, keep one by one okay same thing what how i'm going to writing right the similar format you need to write okay if spelling mistakes are capital letter and small letters are missing right that moment again it will fail android okay then again we need to use for app package app package that is app package we used for uh, we already see right how we can able to see android dot settings okay and then we have for app activity there is one more thing this is important actually app activity that is uh, dot settings okay and then we can able to use for language is another one this is optional actually language but if you provide that is a good okay e n english then uh, lo local also you can provide for provide or not provide also there is no issue okay this is option that th this two okay then you have to use for url url become i'm going to use for http colon two slashes local host colon four seven two four because we use it for four seven two four server right for that particular server connectivity purpose okay then you can uh, uh, reformat and then here you can able to use for driver equal to a web driver a dot a remote you have to choose for remote because we need to connect with the remote session okay and here we need to use for url that is the first option okay and second option you need to use for uh, options and there you have to use for uh, appm options dot load capabilities okay load capabilities that is uh, i'm going to use for cap okay this is a cap we are providing okay once we provided we need to click for that particular element right for this like i showed that right here the battery we need to click after opening the settings i need to click for battery for battery purpose i'm taking for x path the how x path and all we need to take that i will show you for later video okay dot find element and then by 
equal to an appm by dot x path and value equal to and single quotation two crosses star at the rate text how the locator will work and all i'll show you in the later video session okay don't worry about it and just you can uh, do it now battery okay then el dot click option and then i'm going to use for driver dot quit this quit and all it will go for very quick i don't worry about it okay now everything i make it okay now your server is up and running and also your code is ready and also your emulator also ready okay before running you have to close all the things now i'm going to run my app and you can see now if everything is working as expected now something platform sorry the naming conventions are wrong platform platform i mentioned if something is missed out and it will show you what exactly it is and uh, any mistakes are there and you can able to get it now see settings are open and battery also click and it is closed okay this is a way we can able to create our automation scripting and later video session i will show you the locator how you can able to uh, click one particular app and how we can able to locate and locators and how many locators are there see selenium locators are different when you are coming from appm locators are different both are different approaches but the way you are going to achieve is different okay if you click here enter you can see there is a x path id name image custom is there accessibility id and data matching ui automator like this there are so many things are there locators are so many is there based upon your convenient we need to use it okay that i'll show you into a later video session thank you for watching